Tonight, a woman from Austin is back on American soil after being imprisoned in Antigua after vacationing there. We're told Shannon Martinez accidentally left a box of ammo in a suitcase pocket before the trip. Customs at the airport found it as she and her family were leaving the island on Tuesday. She was arrested and sentenced the next day to a year in prison for violating Antigua's firearms law. Now that's according to the Austin Fire Department, where Martinez's husband is a battalion chief. Fire officials told KXAN's Jacqueline Powell they helped work on a deal for her release. It's still so uh, surreal that, that you go from ending a 10-day fantastic vacation uh, to getting on a plane that, to, to being sentenced to prison. And Austin it, Fire Division promoted. Chief Palmer Buck says the AFD family was in shock uh, in hearing what happened to Shannon Martinez. Her husband, Eddie, is a longtime member of AFD. How scary was it hearing about the conditions, uh, hearing that this all happened so fast? I mean, just, just trying to grasp because the first thing we knew, it's like, no, wait, no, you're talking about she got arrested. No, no, she's been sentenced. She is going, she has been sent to prison. And, and, and so everybody did what we do nowadays, which is Google, and you Google Antigua prisons. That's not a good Google. Buck says co-workers and friends across Austin pitched in. And the Austin Fire family uh, takes care of, of its own, and so people are rallying together with next steps and, and gathering money and, and, and working on contacts. Who do you know? Who do you know in the State Department? Who do you know? And we're going to make this right. Buck says as agencies here in Texas began working a deal to get Martinez out of the Antiguan prison, everyone was ordered to keep quiet. We don't know what uh, transpired to, to come to this happy ending. We're just happy that uh, they're back in the United States and we're going to start getting them back to as close to normal as we can. Jacqueline Powell, KXAN News. And we know the Martinez family is back in the States, but we're waiting to find out when they'll be back in Austin.